Robert De Niro has once again shown his disdain for Donald Trump during a very public and profane presentation. Sorry, I just get so upset with that jerk off in the White House, the 75-year-old actor apologized to the audience while presenting Billy Crystal with the Friars Club Entertainment Icon Award in New York City Monday night. Boo is right, he emphasized as the crowd emphatically booed the president. Down with this motherfucker. The outburst came just two days after he appeared on Saturday Night Live portraying special counsel Robert Mueller and weeks after the actor was mailed a pipe bomb allegedly by one of the president's supporters targeting liberals. I shouldn't be going off on my pal Billy Crystal. It's a special night, De Niro said to an audience that included actress Meg Ryan, Larry King and Katie Couric. But why make him the entertainment icon? We should be making him president. It should be easy, De Niro continued. Even half the population that doesn't like yous, they like you in the same way they used to like Sammy Davis Jr. The Oscar winner added that there were a few characteristics that separate Crystal from Trump, according to Variety. There will be a few things to overcome. First, Billy doesn't lie, he joked. I don't think it's because he doesn't want to, the poor schmuck doesn't know how to. Next is the problem of his scandals, he doesn't have any. And your marriages? A total of one. De Niro said alluding to Donald Trump's three marriages. Dot as much as we can use in the never been more white White House, I think it's best to keep you right where you are, making us laugh like no one else, he said. The actor concluded his Trump spiel with one final jab. Dot we've got a dangerous buffoon in chief, he said to the receptive audience. What we need is a heroic comedian and chief. Dot Crystal was eventually presented the award and quipped at the length of De Niro's rant. I was clean shaven when this started tonight, he said. Dot De Niro is one of the president's most outspoken and high profile critics. Dot the actor notoriously yelled F Trump on stage at the Tony Awards this year in June as the audience rose to their feet for a standing ovation. Dot he then apologized to Canadians for the idiotic behavior of my president. Dot his opposition of the president may have been motive for a pipe bomb to be mailed to his Tribeca home last month, along with other liberal elites. Dot package bombs were sent to the actor along with Joe Biden, the Clintons and Obamas as well as CNN's office in New York City. Dot Caesar Sayoc has been indicted on 30 counts Friday for allegedly mailing the bombs. Dot De Niro responded by calling on people to vote in last week's midterm elections. Dot I thank God no one's been hurt and I thank the brave and resourceful security and law enforcement people for protecting us, De Niro said in a statement. There's something more powerful than bombs, and that's your vote. People must vote, the actor said.